Hey everybody, welcome back to another new video. I hope you all are doing really good. So today I'm going to fix this motherboard and this is a Asus S410U motherboard and this motherboard has short circuit in main power rail which is 19 volt power rail. So now I'm trying to find out the short component on this motherboard and I will try to fix this motherboard. So let's try to fix it. Okay, let me show you the model number of this motherboard. So I need to remove this sticker protection sticker and as you can see here x411 ua revision 2.2 so at first because i already know this motherboard have short circuit in main power rail so let me show you how i will check this so i set my multimeter in beep mode as you can hear so i put this black prop in ground line and the other red prop i touch here you can see no shots here this is the first more spread but uh, when i check this current sense register here as you can see it's showing fully short so what i will do now i will set my power supply in 1.5 volt as you can see and i will inject voltage in this 19 volt power rail so i can touch here and as you can see it's taking more than 2 amps and now i will touch everywhere with my hands okay i can feel heat a little bit in this area so let me put some smoke here and then i will so let me put some smoke here in this area and then i will inject voltage again Okay, that's enough. So let me show you under my microscope. So as you can see, I covered this full area with the solder smoke. And now I will inject voltage again. let's see okay i can see here as you can see this two mosfet this one and two so you can see this two uh, mosfet is melt this smoke or resin so now i will remove this this mosfet first this is in channel mosfet for charging area for battery charging okay i already opened this so first i will check this mosfet okay it's fully short so let's check here again okay no more beats no more beats let's check this area ok 
okay no more bits so let's replace this end channel mosfet from my donor board so i can take any mosfet end channel mosfet from charging area Here it is. Let's shoulder this. Okay, it's done. <coughs> so now, now I'm going to connect my power supply. Let's check this voltage is okay or not now. So as you can see, we have 19 volt here. Other side of this MOSFET, there is no voltage. So let's check this again. Okay. So this MOSFET shots again. Okay. Let's check this MOSFET again. It's shot again. So let me check this complete line. Okay. This is a BQ 24780S. So, in this case, first I need to replace this charging IC. So now I will replace this IC with this good one I have already. You can see this IC, same number BQ24780S. <coughs> so first I will replace this IC. I hope after replace this IC, this problem will be solved because uh, this two MOSFET controlled by this IC. Okay. 
so let's replace the same channel MOSFET Okay, this is done. So now I will connect my power supply again and let's see. Okay, as you can see, it's turning on. It's turning on. Let's see here. We have the 19 volt present in this condition register here. So now I will check battery. Battery battery. okay so now we'll check battery charging okay or not so it connect battery we connect charger again so now i'll check with my oscilloscope let's connect here okay as you can see it's charged charge the battery charging the battery also so we have successfully fixed this motherboard so let's check the display is okay or not Okay, it's turning on. We have ASUS logo here. So we successfully fixed this problem. So thanks for watching this video.